What is an expungement? What are its limits? Basically what you have is you've got a conviction in a criminal case and you want to do something to limit it. What an expungement does is it permits you to take back the guilty or no contest plea and get the case dismissed. The next crucial question, is it now blanked from my record? Unfortunately, the answer to that is no. When someone runs your criminal record who has the ability to do it, they're going to see the case. They're going to see you were arrested for a crime, but what they'll see next to it is dismissed. So that's the best that you can do in most cases. However, if you have the ability and you have the opportunity to do it, I encourage you to come in. We can sit down. A lot of times I can reduce cases to misdemeanors and then expunge them. It just depends on the circumstances. And don't confuse an expungement with a motion to seal and destroy. That's a juvenile remedy. That's what relates to a juvenile case versus the expungement which relates to an adult case. So if you have a juvenile case and you want to get rid of that record, you can file the motion to seal and destroy. If successful, unlike an adult case, that record will go away and nobody will be able to find it. There's much better protections for juveniles in that regard. Here's why I would get an expungement. If you're successful in expungement, when you go into the private sector and you look for a job, you do not have to reveal the conviction. So if the people do not find the conviction, or even if they find it, you're not doing anything wrong because once it's expunged, it's dismissed and does not exist anymore. The only time you have to reveal an expungement matter is if you're contracting with the lottery, seeking a state license, or running for a public office. Other than that, if a case has been expunged, you do not have to reveal it.